Hello and welcome to episode 5 of my Risen and Rises series and uh, as you may have seen I've prepared some gas tears and I could I can now do that so my glass is there or not mm, I'll find it and I come back later welcome back guys and as you may have noticed I haven't touched at glass and I'm just harvesting those iron crops because I was extremely low on iron and those gold crops because I was extremely low on gold Ooh, I never see it Okay, but en enough of that. So what have I done is I've made some mine camp stuff. This basically you make a microscope at first and then this is one of this chemist journal which is just a book and a piece of glass. Then you put stuff that you want to analyze in there and here it will tell you how to synthesize it and how it you decompose it. For for example iron gives me F E element and if I put that here it will learn that so when I open it I can access it and this is what I've got the jungle sh the jungle wood when you put it through this machine makes cell loaves uh, at four percent two at four percent chance and this makes eight at fifty percent chance so this is the periodic table and so what is important well this synthesizes you can create um, the items from that and I don't have a synthesizer machine yet so I think I could get one going like if I did this, this and throw that in there because you need a block of iron and a lot of piston. When I mean a lot, I mean eight. Which is a lot. So, and what it does basically, you put it in, it's like a crafting table with, with elements, and you put it like them, like so, how it tells you, and. Oh, I should stop clicking on that. And I sh and it will um, you be able to craft them? Uh, it's a hundred percent automatable, so yeah. So here we go. Um, that was what I did, and I made that, which took me a few hours, literally a few hours and it grows basic crops rubber wood now I have upgraded those barrels and I've put a void upgrade on them basically and if it, it's full any more, I see it's full and any more items that get, that will, that will um, and try to go in this barrel will get instantly deleted because else it will stop completely my farm by clogging up the pipe so this is upgraded this and this is oh my god I'm full on redstone essence and I, I bet this is full too and I've got never essence oh I got some oak wood basically I was trying to make Java barrels, but I didn't have the um, the oak the, the the logs because for some reason it doesn't take rubber wood. What I've done is I sawmill them. I get some glue, which is slime balls, and jungle wood, and I decompose it and then put it back together into oak wood at the cost of power, of course.
so um I, I was gonna craft the synthesizers machine but I need some sh uh, temporarily and um Like that, and I need some cobblestone, of course, to make some pistons. Which is no here, and I need half stack. Right, then you make your eight pistons, then a block of iron. Just gonna cook some more iron because I will need it to make the machine. Just pulverize it before anything else. Then you put the block of iron, you surround it by pistons, and you get atomic manipulator. Now you you want to I've already made this and you want to make that. So I'll need a piece of redstone and some iron on either side. The core and the diamond. And I'm gonna get um, diamond crops going soon. And this isn't—I'm not liking this setup. It works quite well, but I really don't like it. So what I'm gonna do instead is use this this area as a big tree farm. But not just only growing rubber trees, I will growing, be growing rubber trees and all kinds of different trees. And then upstairs I'll make some 3x3 three three farms with a hyper torch because this one is creating so much stuff. So. Yeah, uh, I've not even taken the diamond. I think it's here, yeah. Do, 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 do. Right, this is our chemical synthesis and access machine. As the decomposer, it requires power. So, wh what is really cool is you can choose a recipe, like iron ingots, and then you plug that in here, and ta -da, it gets stored. Oh, good place it here and see it's already there now if you want you can also make it by hand like that and take whole stacks at a time so what I wanted to make it was java barrels and uh, and slabs Slabs, you and you. Bare barrels, and I only need two because I've added never crops, and they haven't yet get to got a place to go. Is this full? No, it isn't. No, it is not. Oh, I know why I haven't got a lot of never crops because they aren't near a torch. I'll just simply move that one and instead of that regular torch just put a hyper torch and just break this oh because they are frozen oh 
when they are frozen like that you just need to punch the entity and I think it's a really horrible feature is it on hyper mode? yeah hyper mode and of course I've got out and the second thing I need to do is plug this here, plug this here, like that now I'm gonna show you how Jabba Barrel's upgrades work so at Jabba just another better barrel attempt so what do I want to make first? well first I need to make a stru stru structural upgrade why because um just a sec ah oh, you may be able to see that when you go over a void upgrade you can see it clearly says slots 2 so it requires two slots to be inserted and this gives only gives one slot one slot but if you, you you need so you need to do that you use that one but if you want to use the second upgrade you need the first one so I'll just take some quick planks of course they fell on the ground and of course I reverse this this is wood and then this is uh, there is iron so and this is the, the void upgrade which is extremely easy to be honest you just need a couple of pistons and some cobble this is really annoying me I just wished I had an A system and that's what I, why I got never crops going because I AE AE I AE requires a lot of never quartz and I really don't want to go mine it of course and yeah I think I have some obsidian in there haven't I yep do I really need it to be centered oh, I guess so. Ah, thunderstorm. It has been raining forever. So what I want to upgrade is this one. Is uh, any other one getting completely filled up? No. So I want to upgrade it once. Uh, shift right click, and as you can see, up my whaler. Wh whaler is taming me one upgrade slot on one available. But I rec I need two. So see you need at least two to apply this if I apply that as you can see when you have uh, upgrade items you, you can see the, the numbers now we have three upgrade slots available uh, if I plug this in it's it it voids any extras it will get will get I've already put a void upgrade on that I should really upgrade every one, every single one of these with a void upgrade, but yeah, at some point I'll do that. Oops, sorry. Um, yeah, that's about it. That's what I done in between the cuts. Now we were going to make the the, the thing, and I didn't notice that the glass was just in front of my eyes. And of course I use I have it in my inventory now. So three glass balls and one two three filled up. Now I know this is this isn't going to work because I need never water at first. And I I had some never water, but yeah, of course. Yep, here. Just put a simple never wart in, and this will go. Just takes a bit of time, and then we need the gas here. So, magnum torch, 
Magnum Torch, yes. Two logs, five chandelier, and ten gold ingots, and five diamonds. Which I'm not too worried for diamonds. I have, as I have a fortune pick, and I can. To be honest, I have. I already have the stuff to get um, a magical crops um, thing going. I need tell gold, tell gold ingots, and I need a bunch more torches. A bunch more torches. So coal and sticks. Suddenly the music seems loud for me. Just one percent is good, I think. And I know I'm wasting some coal, but I don't really care. I know I did went a bit overkill, but... And chandeliers do really good decorations. No, but those are slabs. Like that. Can I really not? But I don't okay. Quite cool, they give off light and... Yeah. But the magnum torch is way better. I need regen too, so I need closer, okay. No problems. Um no. And I need logs, which I'm gonna get by synthesizing C and it doesn't yield so lose each time. Like that. And like that, and I basically need the two potions. One out of which is it two? Yeah, two again. I might want to make uh, some glowstone crops. So I know this this um, magical crops is really. Um, Powerful, but I want to do some really cool stuff which will take tons of resources and well, I need to get glowstone for that. Hmm, do I really not have any? I'm 100% sure that I had had some. No. Glowstone. Glowstone Essence. Crusher. Probabilizer. This right now. Uh, fish. Uh, fish from my. Oh, phosphorus. Which I can get out of phosphat. Which I can get out from. Hydro things. Oh, I can get glowstone from bones. <laughs> it's a bit cheaty, <laughs> to be honest. First of all, when you're synthesizing an item. I highly recommend you to uh, thank you to learn about him and just just throw all of them like that and I 
I got a seed so I could get fire, so I could get lava, but I never did actually use them. Get rid of this first fire, first fade. <laughs> like that. No recipe. Okay, glowstone. Then synthesize this machine. Oh, because I need to decompose it first. Decompose the iron. Ion, not iron. 36 phosphorus. That. Like that. And uh, we'll learn about glowstone in here. See, this mine cam is awesome. And oxygen. Yep, I got some glowstone. Mm. Just make a couple more bottles, and when I say couple, I mean three. And the never what? Already got the glycerin melon and up. Potion of Regeneration 2. I'm getting really messy, but I promise I will get you in a system probably next episode. I just want to make this Magnum Torch and then we'll wrap up the whole episode. The last thing we need to do is em no, empower them with instant health. Instant health. Um, I mean, reading our hands there, and then instant health. And I for that I need instant health two, which will require a s single piece of, of glowstone diamonds. And then you're gonna see me for the next ten minutes harvesting crops. Well, I'm, I'm, I'm actually joking. How much did you loft? Yeah, I figured out. I'm actually joking. And before my favorite bye bye, Magnum Torch in a 64 block radius from the torch, no mobs will ever be able to spawn, which will provide me um, quite uh, a quite cool nights without anyone annoying me. An Enderman! Thank you! So, I hope you guys have enjoyed. Um... I did a, a real lot of stuff in this episode, trust me. Oh, some like essence. And as you, guys, as you can see, I've got a lot of stuff from Magical Crops. And I primarily want to get the Diamond Crops, just to be able to get the best um, Infusion Stone, because each time I need to swap stones to be able to make the right stuff, then from the strong there's the extreme and then the master I can maybe show you yeah 
extreme and then if my game doesn't crash yep master which you can use for everything and this is the extreme essence which you can use to make diamond platinum uranium yes you can even grow uranium which you might abuse might will remember in minecraft everything you create is gonna be used as you, d you do you know I meant you is gonna be used as you would have never intended it to and you can make some extremely good armor with this but I'm not gonna bother oh you can milk uh, also make cobalt I think our diet is a tier below and um, with the skulls so thank you guys for watching hope you've liked this episode Bye-bye.